Welcome back, everyone. Hello. Today, let's look at using conjunctions to write longer sentences. Run on sentences can also be fixed with conjunctions. This video is part one. There are many example sentences in this video, so you can learn about conjunctions. You can find the link to part two below, and you can practice using conjunctions in video two. I'll teach you about seven very useful words called coordinating conjunctions. It's a long, scary word, but it's not that hard. You will be able to use these seven coordinating conjunctions to write better, longer, and more interesting sentences. And you can remember these words with fanboys. Fanboys is an acronym to help you remember all seven coordinating conjunctions. The F is for, and, nor, but, or, yet, and so. The word fanboys just helps you remember all seven. Number one, for. For is a word that has many different meanings. Here, it is used like the word because. It can show a reason. For example, I was late. My car ran out of gas. We can put these together with for. I was late for my car ran out of gas. Just like the word because, it works. I was late because my car ran out of gas. She was tired the next day. Her baby cried all night. She was tired the next day, for her baby cried all night. For shows the reason why she was tired. Next is and. And is a word that can connect similar things, sentences, or ideas. It can be used like the word also. The oven was still on. The window was open. Connect them with and. They're similar. The oven was still on, and the window was open. It will rain tomorrow. It might snow the next day. Both are about what might happen, so they're similar. It will rain tomorrow, and it might snow the next day. Nor is next, and this one's a little tricky. Nor is a word that can connect two negative sentences or ideas. Negative sentences usually have no or not in them. Sarah didn't like math. She didn't like English. These are both negative sentences. She didn't like math, nor did she like English. And you can see it changes to the question form here. Did she like English? My teacher is not mean. He doesn't give a lot of homework. Not and doesn't are negative words. My teacher is not mean, nor does he give a lot of homework. We invert and make the question form. It's a little tricky to use the word nor. But. But is a word that can show a difference or a change between two sentences or ideas. I bought fish for dinner. I forgot to buy vegetables. There's a difference there. One of them is okay, and one is not okay. I bought fish for dinner, but I forgot to buy vegetables. We have time to play tennis. The court is closed now. Connect them with but. We have time to play tennis, but the court is closed now. Wah, wah. Or. Or is a word that can show a choice between two sentences or ideas. We can wait in line for the movie. 
We could eat dinner first. This is we can choose between these two things. We can wait in line for the movie or we could eat dinner first. Here is another choice. She might get a belt for him. She might buy him a book. Put them together for a better sentence. She might get a belt for him or she might buy him a book. The next one is yet. And yet is a word that is a lot like the word but. It can show a difference or a change. Ted didn't want to go to the party. He actually enjoyed it. There's a difference. Ted didn't want to go to the party, yet he actually enjoyed it. I didn't study very hard. I got a good score on the test. I didn't study very hard, yet I got a good score on the test. There's a difference between the beginning and the end. Last, we have so. So is the opposite of for or because. For and because show the cause. So shows the effect. It was raining all afternoon. I stayed home and read. It was raining all afternoon, so I stayed home and read. It was raining, and so shows what happened next, the effect. He was really hungry after school. He ate a lot of snacks. We can use so to put these together. He was really hungry after school, so he ate a lot of snacks. All right, to review, for is because or the reason for something. And connects two similar ideas. Nor connects two negative ideas. But shows a difference or a change. Or shows a choice. Yet also shows a difference or a change. And so shows the effect or the result of something. Check out the next video to practice using fanboys conjunction words. You can find the link to part two below. Thanks for watching, everyone.